Hey, this is Mikey with another After Effects quick tip. Today I want to show you how to use the puppet tool with text. And let me show you what happens when you use the puppet tool normally with text. I've got the puppet tool, click, and well, that's not what I want. I want to warp this text, kind of, you know, with the puppet tool, and everything's just kind of moving around. And this is cool in its own right, but that's not what I wanted to do. See, if I turn on the mesh, you can see that it's just selecting just the layer, just the, the letter itself, because this is a vector object. But I want to select the whole thing as a whole. So let's go in, take that puppet tool off, back to normal. And if I want to select it and bend it as I would a normal layer, what you do is just take a mask, mask around it, and then when you use the puppet tool, your first pin needs to not be on a letter. So just go right off to the side. And now I can move the whole thing as if it was a single layer and I don't have to pre-compose it first. So that's how to use the puppet tool with your text layers, or this would work with any of your vector layers as well.